Hi everybody! Today we are learning about the percussion family and we're gonna make our very own paper plate maraca. Uh, so the percussion family is a super fun part of the orchestra. They are the people in the back who get to hit a bunch of things. So the way that percussion works is by vibrating the actual instrument. So instead of you know blowing air like you do for a woodwind or a brass or vibrating a string like you do for uh, the, the string instruments, the sound actually is made by vibrating the instrument itself. So with a drum, it's you hit the head of the drum and that vibrates and makes a sound. Or maybe with uh, marimba, you know, you hit the mallets on top of the marimba and that vibrates to make the sound. So they're a very unique and diverse group of instruments. So there's so many different types of instruments in this family. We've got bass drums. We've got triangles, we've got marimbas, basically anything that you hit and makes noise technically can be a percussion instrument. So pots and pans and big buckets and spoons and all these different types of things, they can be percussion instruments, which is really super fun. Today, what we're gonna be doing is making a paper plate maraca. So maracas are those little things that in the back. We're gonna make those, but out of a paper plate. So what you're gonna need for this is you're gonna need two paper plates, some string, some tape maybe, and then beans or rice, something that will make noise when you shake it. All right, so this is what you're gonna do. Step one, you're gonna take your two paper plates with the eating side in and you're gonna stick them together like this, right? So there's a little bit of space in between the two. Then you're gonna go all the way around the edge and you're gonna poke holes. So what I did is very, very carefully, adults, this is for you, I took the edge of scissors and I just bore a little hole in it like this. I just wiggled back and forth to put a little bit of a hole. Right, so I did that and I did that all the way around the rim, making sure that the holes lined up. After you have all of those holes done, I did, I left maybe about three inches in between each one. What I did is I stuck string through the holes, tied a knot so that it was affixed, all right? So I, I tied one here and here and here and all the way around and I left two, three of the holes at the top open. So once you have it all the way affixed, you're gonna open this up and you're gonna stick beans in there. Don't fill it up all the way. Just put some beans, some rice, so that when you close it up and shake it, it makes a nice sound. Then I close those up by tying some string. Um, and then I have my uh, maraca, my paper plate maraca. So you see what I did there? All the way around the edge, we've got all those holes that I tied strings on. Then I took tape and I taped in between just for prettiness. And then I wrote Kitten Symphony Orchestra on it just for fun. So here we are, we have our paper plate maraca. Super fun, all right? So hold this, keep it around the house, try it with other things, maybe you make a set. Uh, you can also do this with um, paper towel racks. You can do this with toilet paper rolls. Just tape each end, stick beans in there. You can do this with a whole bunch of stuff, which is super duper fun. So show me your maracas in the comments, and I can't wait to see what you come up with. Everyone have a great day. Bye.